Up in Moscow, the Idaho Vandals are going to look a lot different this season, whether it be losing stars like Giovanni McCoy and Anthony Woods to the transfer portal or the graduation of longtime standouts like Hayden Haddon and Jermaine Jackson finishing out their playing careers. Last week during National Signing Day, head coach Jason X started to rebuild for 2024, sticking with his core value of building the team with players from the Northwest. Of 28 signees, 19 of them hail from Idaho, Washington or Oregon. The Vandals currently rank as the 153rd best cl recruiting class in D1 football, signing 15 three-star recruits. Eck noted that focusing on the Northwest limits Idaho's competition with only four FCS schools and one group of five schools in those three states. Also, it allows Idaho to find some hidden gems as they assemble their roster. You know, the, the metro markets that are driving distance to us, which really there's only three, you know, it's, uh, you know, the the Seattle Tacoma metro area, the Portland metro area, the Boise metro area. Uh, you know, again, those got to be our stalwarts, man. And again, we got to get our our brand well known in those areas with the high school coaches, with the families. And, you know, again, th those are three states where we really got to try to target the best players who are not, you know, power five players in those states. And, uh, you know, there's some, uh, you know, there's uh, there's opportunities there. And uh, again, I think those have to be our our, uh, our home bases. So the Vandals picked up five signees from the state of Idaho, four from right here in the Treasure Valley. Hawaii quarterback Matt Irwin will be moving to the other side of the ball to play safety for the Vandals. Eagle tight end Cal Hewish and offensive lineman Leon Evans signed as well. And Timberline tight end Aiden Nixon is also committing to play in Moscow. The Vandals will continue to recruit through the late signing period on February 7th, also looking to pick up some college transfers in the coming weeks. We're back after this.